The flames and the fury that volunteers face in the field. This video, filmed by a volunteer firefighter on the New South Wales north coast, was played for the commissioners. A quarter of a million Australians make up the nation's volunteer network, sometimes leaving their day jobs for weeks or even months. Our employers um, and certainly the self-employed are often the unsung heroes of, of fire campaigns. They are making just as much sacrifice sometimes in releasing their employees. Do your volunteer firefighters want to be paid? No, they do not want to be paid. But they do want more recognition. When you're asking people to do a very difficult, dangerous job and give their time free, um, I think the most important thing we can give them is, is, is respect. While the last fire season led to an increase in people signing up, overall the ranks are shrinking and ageing. They could also do with more women. I've been a member of the um, brigade since 1999. Before that, um, girls weren't encouraged to be on trucks. Um, but I became captain in 2008. The Royal Commission is considering whether there should be more centralised oversight at a federal level to coordinate bushfire emergencies. But the perception of increasing bureaucracy is already causing some volunteers to leave, worried they're losing control on the fire ground. Can I thank you and your brigades for the service that you do for your communities, uh, often in pretty horrendous conditions. Uh, and often at times where everyone else is taking time off. They were never more on duty than the summer just gone. Anna Henderson, ABC News, Canberra.